So you're, you're very special to me because I've learned a lot about the culture here in Rwanda. Um, some of the things that I taught and coached you as, as we've gone through these four days kind of changed the way I looked and approached teaching and coaching as well because you said to me there was a couple of things that I was doing that was not accepted in your culture. How can you take what you've learned and apply it in Rwanda? Uh, I think there are plenty of ways that you can take that and apply it in our culture. Because, first of all, what we saw in what you did, for example, kneeling down, what we saw was the intention of uh, humbling yourself or mm -hmm. connecting with a student. So I think it will be so easy for us to know the ways that we can use, the ways that we normally use to approach a, a kid. So, for example, when you try to lean a little bit down and then you talk to them eye, at eye level, I think that can work very well. And anchoring, we... Okay, we are huggers, not to people that we meet for the first time. Right. But when we get used to it, we hug, uh, we hug our, our students. Oh, that's great. And uh, I think plenty of the ways that you showed us, we can find the intention behind, and then we can find a way to apply it. Not only meaning that we cannot change a little bit of our culture and then try to yeah. balance it with what we've learned. But I appreciate you having me. Thank you so much. Thank you. you were excellent. Thank you. Thank you.